Hey guys, welcome to today's video. My name is Rick and I appreciate you watching. Today we're going to check out the Luna Life Mattress 2.0. And if you guys have been around here a long time, you know that I'm a big fan of Luna Life and all of their products. In fact, after I purchased my first mattress from them, I became an ambassador. It's more about supporting the company. And if you check out the description below, you'll also get a discount code if you want to end up purchasing one of these guys. And I can't honestly say enough about how much I like the original mattress. And basically they just made some improvements with this guy. So we're gonna check it out. This mattress actually fits about 1800 vehicles. And they also have a van mattress and I believe some kind of front seat mattress as well for a van. So along with a bunch of other accessories dedicated to car camping and just making that a more enjoyable experience, check out luno.com or lunolife.com for more of that stuff. They also sent along uh, a shoe storage bag for me to check out. So um, these guys, full disclosure, these were sent to me. I did not purchase this 2.0, but as always, I'm gonna give you my honest opinion. I have no reason to lie to you or to tell you things that aren't true about a product. So great company, great warranty, great features. What I wanted to do is get it out of the box and I'm actually gonna set it up right over here in my house first. So you can get a shot of the mattress and we can go over all the features um, in an open area so that you can see it. Then I'm gonna take it outside. I'm gonna put it in the Crosstrek so you can see it in the Crosstrek if you've never seen one of these mattresses set up before. So I put my original video out on the first mattress that I purchased from Luno about three years ago. And the biggest negative I hear from people are it's too expensive and that they could just go to Walmart and buy a $25 mattress and be just as comfortable. And there are some people that's probably true. You probably could be comfortable on that mattress. But if you love car camping, if you spend a lot of time out camping and you want a product that is dedicated and designed to be used in your car, that's easy to set up, that's easy to take down, that's small in size for storage and for transporting to the campsite, that has awesome features, that's durable, that has a one year warranty and an extendable lifetime warranty. Um, you have to check this mattress out. I don't think there's any comparison personally to something like a Walmart mattress to this guy here. This is a, a dedicated purpose built mattress. So whether or not it's up to you to spend that kind of money, it's your choice. But um, like all good camping gear, you know, it's not cheap, but if it's quality, it's worth it and it makes your night out much better in my opinion. So let's get this out of the box. And like I mentioned, we're gonna set it up here first and we'll check it out and then we'll go outside and set it up in the car. One of the cool things is, is the mattress comes with a cool carrying case, um, a nice little handle on it and you can see its size. So I'm 5'9", this will give you an idea of how big it is. This will easily fit in your car carrier, in your uh, the back of the car and a transport basket, whatever, wherever you want to store it. It's uh, very easy to do. It comes with the pump, which can be used to quickly inflate the mattress and or help you deflate it when you are all done. And that's just plugs right into your lighter and it has little adapters that go with it. Some instructions. One of the other unique features about the Luna Life mattress, if you've never seen them before, they have these little uh, blocks that can help you extend the reach of your mattress. So you move your seats all the way forward, you blow these up, and then the uh, front of the mattress actually rests on these blocks, and I'll go over that with you and show you that when we get out to the car. But a very cool, unique feature of the Luna mattress. And it also has easy inflate and easy adjustment valves. If you blow it up too much, it's very easy to adjust to take it down to the right size. All right, so here's the mattress. You can see how nice it folds down. We're gonna get this set up now in my living room. So we're gonna show you how this guy sets up. I brought in my little uh, power bank so we can use the 12 volt inflator in here. But basically, you want to Roll out the mattress and figure out how it's oriented here in the packaging. So as you can see, you have little marks on here that show you the pillow where the pillows go, 
and that's how you want this to be up. You can also tell by the writing on the uh, mattress itself. The mattress has these little wings on it which helps fit by the doors of the car. You have your deflate valves here and as you notice these can be utilized either both at the same time or you can blow up one or the other, tuck the other side over and just use one side. You don't always have to blow up the entire mattress to use it. It's independent. As you can see right here, each mattress is independent or each chamber. So you can sleep with just one person or two. Here's your inflate valve right there. So let's go ahead and inflate this guy real quick. So you can see that's really a quick setup. And I've got this mattress firmer than this side. And again, I want to show you that these are independent of each other. So you can see here that they're two separate, uh, two separate mattresses. Now, if during the night, if you want to adjust, say you're on here and you're like, oh man, that's, that's, too, much, that's too much air in there. You can adjust it. There's a little button here, like a little valve that you can push and adjust it during the night. Let me show you um, how you can just fold this under and just use one side at a time. If you want to store gear next to you when you're sleeping in the back, you just blow up one side. Or if you're just there with yourself, same thing. So, again, you can just tuck that guy underneath there and just sleep on one side, which is also very cool. With that being said, I'll go ahead and deflate the other side and then we'll go out and we'll put it in the cross truck so you can see how it works inside the car. One of the things I loved about the original mattress and this one is the same way, is how easy the air comes out. A lot of these kind of blow up mattresses and other things are very difficult to get everything out and to get it back in the bag that they came with. This one actually deflates very easily even without using the, the uh, little inflator. So cool stuff there. The only thing I didn't do here is you can, you can also fold in the little wings if you want. So now we're already down to the shape that we need to, to get back in the bag. So good stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and set up the Little Life mattress in my 2018 Crosstrex. You can see how well it fits back here and how easy it is to set up. To start with, you're gonna to wanna to move your seats all the way forward, including the seat backs, move those forward. So just like that. So then we're gonna to move to the back seat and you're going to put your seats down and it actually helps also to remove the headrests because you want the blocks to have a spot. One of the other questions I've been asked many times over the years is what do you do with your gear when you're sleeping in the back of the car? And that's a great point. Um, obviously there's some room up front. You can put some gear up front if you want, put it on top of the vehicle. If you have a roof basket, store it underneath. Um, if it's an area where you don't feel comfortable doing that, you can also set up a small tent next to the car and stick your stuff in a tent. And I've done that before. It just really depends on the situation um, and, and what your comfort level is. But that's kind of the choices that you have there. Or if you're just using one side of the mattress, you can just uh, store it next to you in the car. All right, seats are down. Now, we talked about those blocks earlier. And you can see that you have some some room back here behind your seats and the mattress is actually going to extend all the way up here. So we're going to blow those blocks up and sit them behind each seat. Okay. Um, you want to start by putting the block in the well, you're going to open up the inflate section here. You can 
pump them up all the way if you want to start, see what you think. All right, so there are the blocks. And there's a little bit better shot of the valves. The adjustment valve is right in there. I'm not sure if you can see that, but there's a little membrane in here. That makes for easy adjustment. All right, let's plug in the mattress and get that guy blown up. One of the things that Lunar Life has done that's nice is the inflate valves are towards the front so that you don't need to have a gigantic cord on your inflator and it will fit um, on your uh, cigarette lighter either in the console or up front. Okay, you have to be smarter than the mattress. <laughs> when we were filming inside, I forgot to uh, plug the deflate hole. So. So let's take a look at how this fits in here. You can see how the blocks work now. That's to give you uh, some pressure underneath it to keep the mattress firm as you extend it up over the open space behind the seats. And this mattress will allow you to sleep someone up to about six foot two, according to Luno. As you'll see in a second, I'm five foot nine-ish, so you'll be able to tell how I fit in here and kind of get an idea of what you think. Um, I think someone taller than six two, if you have both pads inflated and you'd lie at an angle, you could fit. But beyond that, you'll see with the Crosstrek specifically uh, as well, you're not gonna have enough room. All right, so here we are down on this end. And you can see these cutouts are made to fit around into the door areas here, just give you a little bit more room. And one of the things we've talked about in the past in my when I made the sleeping platform and then with other the other Luna Life mattresses, the Crosstrek isn't totally flat back here, but this does do a pretty good job of hiding that. Um, it's going to kind of be your choice when you pick one of these up if you decide you want to build up this lower section because it is still at a little bit of a slant down there. For me, when this with this mattress back here, it's fine. You don't really need it. And here's a quick look at how much room you actually have if you just want to sleep on one side, which is a great option. I did a video on this before. This is the sheet, the fitted sheet that goes with the Luna Life mattress. And this is another nice option for you. I'm just going to throw this on real quick. You can check out the other video and I'll leave a link in the description or you can check out my, uh, my video list. But this is another cool option. So there you go, there's the fitted sheet, another nice option. The other thing they sent along this time was a sh little shoe bag. And you might just think, oh, it's just a bag. What's the big deal out of it? Well, it's waterproof. It attaches to the car with uh, four magnets that are protected so it doesn't scratch the car. It's also has a mesh on the bottom so that your shoes, if they're wet, they can drain and it'll fit a pair of hiking boots and or a couple of pair of smaller shoes. Um, so it's actually a really cool little bag and nice accessory from Luno. So here I got my head all the way to the top. And if you look at my feet there, you can see I do have some room down at the bottom. And again, Luno says six foot two will fit. Um, plenty of room. The mattress um, takes advantage of the most room in the car with those flaps on the sides and then extends all the way to the sides of the car. It still may be a little bit cramped with two people, but you're in the back of the car, so you know that's just the way it's going to be. Um, the sheet itself is made specifically for the 2.0 mattress, so you will see here that it has a little flap. You can just open the flap during the night if your mattress is too firm and adjust a little bit here and there. Uh, one of the things I love about the mattress is that adjustability. All right, so you can get a, a better idea of how this looks in here with me 
from the side maybe this shows you kind of where you're at purpose made fits excellently 1800 vehicles puncture resistant material you can have your dog on here year warranty that can be extended to the lifetime of the mattress easy up easy down easy to adjust small storage so it's easy to carry with you to your campsite and to pack into your vehicle it's just an awesome mattress honestly it really is a great mattress and if you're looking for something to sleep in the back of your car this is very very hard to beat so i highly recommend it check out the description below for a discount code and if you have any questions as always please let me know and i'm happy to help you thanks for watching